Witnesses say the train never seemed to slow down, hit a safety bumper, went airborne, even took down the roof. It went up and over the bumper block, through the depot, and came to rest at the wall by the waiting room. One person is dead she is seen here on the platform. I ended up stepping over a dead woman's body. That bothered me. You know, I backed up and looked at her. What the? And uh, nothing you can do for her. With over 100 injured, witnesses inside the front car described the impact. It just didn't stop and just got thrown around, lights went out. Uh, I think the roof caved in on the train. Everyone from, that was standing in the vestibules between the first and second car flew over into the first car and many people were like thrown and there was a lot of uh, blood. Officials say at approximately 8.45 a.m., New Jersey Transit train 1614 struck the Hoboken Terminal Building on track five at a high rate of speed, leaving the structure unstable. I heard a bomb-like explosion. Sound like nails, like on a chalkboard, you know what I mean? And then just, just followed by this deafening silence. And then all of a sudden I just hear all these screams coming and terror, like shrieks and everything. And then people just start running towards me up the stairs from all the platforms, just pouring in like right in front of me. Train workers and bystanders rushed to the scene to help passengers trapped in the severely damaged train cars. They were kicking out the windows and trying to get that off the train. They were jumping the turnstiles, climbing up the stairs, like hands and legs, you know, like running up the stairs with their hands and everything. Tonight, investigators focusing on the train engineer who was pulled from the train unresponsive. The engineer who was operating the train was also critically injured. He is at a local hospital and cooperating with law enforcement officials in the investigation.